traveling through this space fog for two days now. Oh, we've got to get out. Oh, we've got to get out, out. I can't stand it much longer. <laughs> What's wrong with the little fog? Everybody says I've been foggy for years. <laughs> it isn't fog. It's a cloud of cosmic dust. Very strange. They say that about me, too. Very strange. <laughs> Quiet. There's something on the radar scope. Probably strawberry ice cream. I dropped some of my dessert on it when I... No, it's something solid. Sure, strawberry. They're solid. <laughs> it's gigantic. And it seems to be made of metal. And we're headed straight for it. present orbit around Jupiter is calculated to remain constant for... Urgent alarm. Turn on the viewer scope. A strange spacecraft. It must have accidentally drifted into our camouflage cloud. It is on a collision course with our planet. Open entry door number seven at once. Precisely. You are in Metallus. N never mind what we're in. Just to to tell us when we're going to get out. That remains to be seen. We're from planet Earth. Uh, you've heard of Earth, haven't you? Indeed. <laughs> yeah, you know. It's that big, round, bumpy place that's completely surrounded by smog. And can we leave now, huh? Please? <laughs> I am Motan, master of Metallus. And you will all remain here. Why? We're not bothering anybody. By blundering into our planet, you have learned too much. Learned too much? Me? You must be kidding, right? <laughs> We've learned too much about what? This overgrown tin basketball? No one dares speak that way to Motan. No? Well, you'll notice that I just did it, Buster. And I have got a lot more to... Quiet! Before I lose my patience with you. She said it. She said it. I've been quiet as a mouse. And scared as a chicken. Galvan, lock them in their quarters, under guard, at once. What a weird world. It's a metallic monster. Here are your quarters. Gee, iron doors. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Nothing's getting me in there. Nothing, noisy one? I just remembered something that is getting me in there. <laughs> Fear, I think. Whee! A musical door. Oh, what a neat trick. Will you toot for us again? That's sweet. We did it again. <laughs> it's a steel room. And somehow, we've got to steal away from here. Oh, to get out of here, we're going to need a can opener. <laughs> nope. 
I think there's some special way to open this door. What good will that do us? We'll still be stuck in this pig iron planet. Yes, but if we can snoop around and find out what Motan is up to, it might help us plan an escape. Aha! Just as I thought, these locks are electronically transistorized to be actuated by the particular frequency of specific sound waves. Amazing! I didn't understand a word you said. She means that's why the doors opened when Galvan blew a certain musical note on that whistle. If the doors need a sour note to open, we're in luck. Josie and the Pussycats are very good at that. Hey, Alexandra, that's a sensational idea. Oh, of course, Alan, dear. Anything for you. Huh? What's a sensational idea? Josie and the Pussycats will play a musical number. And if they hit the right note, it'll open. Okay, Josie, get ready. Me and my sensational ideas. Sheesh. <laughs> You girls pretend you're practicing. And if your number opens the door, the rest of us will sneak out and look around. Join the party. 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 So glad you could make it have to be here. We're so We're out. What are we looking for? Let's try to find Motan's headquarters. That's what I say. Let's try to find Motan's headquarters. Hey, dig this crazy smokestack. Ah! Whoa! 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 worn-out inner tube. Simmer down, Alexander. Up here, people use these big tubes to travel around. You're not hurt. I'm not? Huh? <laughs> yeah, look, I'm not hurt. <laughs> meow. Meow. Yes, the intruders from Earth will be perfect for testing my new age ray. It was fortunate for us that they blundered into our camouflage cloud. Now we can test our age ray missiles on them before we put our plans into action. What is that? Someone is at the window. I don't know what could have happened to that furry brain feline. He must be around somewhere. Hey, what's the big idea scaring us like that, you troublemaking cat? Wait, I think he's trying to tell us something. You're turning on a shower. You're turning switches and dials? Control room. Yes, yes. Jet planes. Missiles? Yeah! They've got some kind of dumb missile in the control room. And they're gonna use them on us. Oh, no, no, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it! Alexander, stop whining. You're right, you're right, it's time to stop whining. Good. And time to start crying. <laughs> Come on now, we've gotta get the other kids. When we're in big trouble like this, we've all gotta stick together. How come I feel like I'm falling apart? Sebastian found Motan's headquarters. And Motan has some kind of missile he's gonna use on us. What kind of missile? I don't know. It's a mystery. Oh, goody! A missile mystery. I love mysteries. They're so mysterious. <laughs> we have only one chance. Get to Motan's control room and destroy those missiles before he can zap us with them. Can Sebastian lead us back to the control room? <laughs> then somebody play the right note and let's get out of here. Let's go, gang. We're all out, Bleep. Come on. Ah, hurry, Bleep. Bleep, Bleep! Howdy.
did they escape from their cell? What does it matter? If they are coming here, it will save us the trouble of going after them. <laughs> Watch it, Melody. A pneumatic people mover. Very clever. I'm next. Some trip, huh, Melody? Golly, it's the only way to fly. <laughs> You, I could find it. Come on. Well, well, why don't I go find Alan and the others? <laughs> we were expecting you. Ha ha. Uh oh. Gee, we wanted to surprise you. Well, where are we? Would you believe it? Even on a monorail, we got lost. I wish we hadn't separated from the others. Maybe we better catch the next car. Wait a minute. I hear voices. So do I. Over there. Yeah, come on. Since you intruders are part of my plans, you may as well know what they are. Haven't you got any cheerful information? I can maneuver Metallus like a giant spaceship to any other planet I choose. Congratulations. Why don't you pull this tin Lizzie up next to Earth and let us off, see? <laughs> Get it? Pull us up. <laughs> do not interrupt again. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. When I fire my age ray missiles to the surface of the other planets, they will transmit a ray which can transform the entire population into small children. Golly, that's neat. I like children, especially boys and girls. I too like children, because I can control their young minds to obey me. And me alone. The door is locked. We can't get in to help them. We have to do something. Now. <laughs> On whom shall I test my age ray first? Not me, you ray happy weirdo. Not me, I'm too tall to be a baby. Not me, my mother gave away all my baby clothes. <laughs> Very well, I shall test it on all of you. You wouldn't dare. Wrong again, sis, he dared, he dared. Yikes, it works. Man, does it work? Oh, baby, it works. Yes. <laughs> My ray is a success. What shall we do with them now? Put them in the holding pens, and then find the others. Shh. We can't let them know we're here. Alexander, did you take my doll? You'll get a good wallop if you did. I want my teddy bear. Hello, teddy. Hello, bear. <laughs> Quiet, and come with me. I won't go unless I can have a dolly all my own. So there. She's still the same old Alexandra. You mean the same old young Alexandra. Look, you can't tell me what to do. Oh, clam up, you kooky little kitten. Let's go. We've got to see where he's taking them. I'm hungry, hungry. I'm Melody, Melody. <laughs> Wow, kindergarten time. Hello there, Alan, dear. You want to fill the sand castle with me? Get off my sandbox. You may sit in it, Alan. <laughs> but not you, you old lady. Oh, boy, oh, boy. We've got to get them back to normal. But how? If we could change the wavelength of the missile's transmitter, it might reverse everything. But the missiles are back in the control room, and Galvan is hunting everywhere for us. If we crawled out through that air duct, he'd never see us. Hey, great idea, Val. Get out of here, you mean old creep. Out! Hmm, Earth children are difficult. Phew. Thanks, Alexandra. You're welcome, Alan. I'd let you be my boyfriend, but you're too old. There, it's off. Let's see if we can catch this tin fish. Got it. 
Take it easy. What are you doing, huh? Trying to fix this thing so we can make you grow up again. When I grow up, I want to be a fireman. When I grow up, I want to go to Cleveland. <laughs> okay, let's see if I made the right changes on this missile. Get ready. Here goes. Wait, wait. Yikes. I think I goofed. Hey, Alex was a cute kid. Yeah, but enough of this kid stuff. Right. Back to the old drawing board. Beat it, kid. Babies aren't allowed in my sandbox. All right, let's try it again. Uh-oh, I think I overdid it. What am I doing in this dirty old sandbox, eh? Alexandra, shh. Don't shush me, you young whippersnapper. Get me out of here. Aha! I knew I heard the other Earth aliens in here. Seize them! Scatter, gang. Hit the lights! Join the party! 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 So glad you could make it have to be here. We're so glad you could come join the party. It is useless to defy us. Phew. Am I glad Moton had more than one of these? Ready, gang? Yes, I'm ready for some milk and cookies. <laughs> That's not exactly what I had in mind, Melody. Stand by. Golly, how time does fly. <laughs> Thanks, pal. Oh, yeah, you sure saved the day. Uh, the years. <laughs> <laughs> Galvan, uh, Moton is gonna need a babysitter for several years. Yes, I know. Well, congratulations. You're elected. <laughs> Uh, my name is Moton. What's yours, huh? Well, we destroyed all their missiles except that one. Now if we can just find our way home. At least we won't get back younger than when we started. <laughs> Don't be too sure. Look at my baby brother. Da, 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 da. Oh, no. Pretty good acting, huh? Huh? <laughs> I was only fooling. <laughs> There's only one way to be sure. This is nothing to fool with. So farewell, Age Changer. We'll all stay the way we are. And like it. <laughs> yeah, but another scary planet like that, and I'll be a gray-haired old man overnight. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>